soon windows update will get a huge changes microsoft is creating a one unified update system which can not only update windows itself but also the applications including third-party applications it's not limited to windows or microsoft only apps i think most of you guys know this is the windows update uh, through this we update our system we get the security updates feature updates and all that but now with this new unified system you'll be able to update your applications a few days ago uh, microsoft posted this article where they talked about this new feature and this is actually already in testing uh, privately so you can see join the private preview so if you're a dev or something you can actually join this right now so i want to give my opinion on this actually is it good is it bad or how is it going to affect or make your life easier so as you guys know almost all the windows apps update themselves separately either you'll get a notification for each application and some apps don't even have a update system you'll have to go to the website uh, to see if there is a new update or not and then download it and then update all the windows apps have their own separate updaters basically they update themselves individually which can be annoying sometime like you'll have to run the updates for each application individually you know what i'm trying to say here but you know what there is a application called winget ui this is a gui application for windows which lets you install applications on windows plus you can update all your applications in one place thanks to the winget thingy on windows uh, if you don't know what that is it's a package manager for windows you can use terminal to you know install applications and all that i think most of you guys already know about this so yeah we kind of have a pretty good you know software updaters now these days again thanks to winget so this is a gui for winget called uniget ui really popular application actually and you can see i actually have some updates available and i can actually update them here uh, at once let's click on update now you can see the update is happening that's all you have to do so basically microsoft is trying to do this on windows itself like without any third-party applications one unified place for updating all your apps plus it will also update your windows system which is in my opinion pretty good idea and using third-party applications like sometime you can get errors like for example right now uh, i can't update the microsoft edge maybe there is some issue with that but now imagine you open the windows updates uh, thingy <laughs> settings and check for update and you see the updates for your windows plus applications now i don't know how microsoft is going to manage both windows and the app updates in my opinion what they should do is actually make two separate section within the windows update where like you see a windows updates and you can only choose to update your windows and second part where you see your apps uh, updates maybe split windows update into two parts and give user more control whether you want to update it right now or later like don't force it because as you guys know microsoft is really good at forcing things on users like microsoft edge you, you can't even uninstall it and all that you know what i'm trying to say here so and for this to work like you want to update your apps through the windows updates the app makers the devs have to actually submit their application or have to use uh, some kind of a api from the microsoft so they can actually you know get the new update and all that i think still there are going to be many apps in the wild which are not going to get updates through the windows updates i'm pretty sure big companies like adobe uh, are not going to join this probably at least not for the uh, main actual applications like adobe photoshop premiere pro and all that maybe they'll put it the adobe creative cloud application in here but not the internal ones which are not internals but i don't really know how to explain this you know adobe has their own application center thingy called adobe creative cloud which you can use to install and update adobe softwares like for example if i search here 
Photoshop in Microsoft Store and you try to install it, you know what's going to get installed? It's not going to install uh, Adobe Photoshop. It's going to install the Adobe Creative Cloud application. And then you'll have to sign in and then you're going to go inside the Creative Cloud application and then you have to click on install button and then you'll get the Adobe Photoshop. So basically what I'm trying to say here is that Adobe likes to manage their things by themselves. They only distribute or provide Adobe Creative Cloud in Microsoft Store or Winget and all that. You get the idea. And to be honest, this is a good thing. Just imagine updating all your applications in one place. It is actually beneficial, like less notifications, for the apps individually you just get one notification that there is an app update basically less annoying pop-ups or notifications i don't know when it's going to be available maybe the next version or maybe the windows 12 who knows we don't know <laughs> maybe they are doing this for the windows 12 like we're gonna make windows 12 the best version of windows ever unified updates removing all the, the you know old components from the system like the control panel and everything I, I don't know i'm just saying okay yeah that's it for this one hope you enjoyed it let me know your thoughts in the comments what do you think about this and if you have any suggestions or have any questions you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comment section too yeah that's it i'll see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye, -bye.